Hi friends, I'm Leah and welcome to DIY Beauty Lab where I figure out how to do all things beauty, anti-aging, and med spa treatments from home. Today I'm going to be using this awesome ultrasonic cavitation device that you can buy yourself, use it at home. This is the ultrasound portion of it that will help explode the fat cells in localized areas on my body. This part right here, the radio frequency device, is going to help my lymphatic drainage system get rid of the fat cells. It also has a really great red light therapy right here. It's going to help firm the skin. Can't wait to show you guys how to use that, so stay tuned. So just a quick disclaimer, I am not a medical professional. I am not a dermatologist or an esthetician. I am just a stay-at-home mom that loves all things anti-aging and beauty. I have done a ton of research online, but I am not a professional, so you have to do any of this stuff at your own risk. I'm just showing you my journey. I got this machine um, actually off of Amazon. It was about $500, and it works great. Now, when people ask me about my machines and whether or not they're as good as the med spas, I always tell them, no, of course they're not as good because those machines are about five to $10,000. This machine was only 500, but if you use it more often, it is as effective. So a rule of thumb is that if you go to one treatment in a med spa, I would say you have to do this machine three times to get the same results. So it might not be as effective as one session there, but if you use it more often, you will see the results. And the great thing is, is that you can use this once a day for 20 minutes. Um, if you read the instructions, on the machine. It says that that's totally safe and so you can use it as much as you want. Now there is a lot of information about this machine that I am not going to try to memorize. I'm just going to go ahead and read this directly off of this instruction manual. Now I'm going to show you exactly how to start this machine, but first I'm going to explain exactly what everything is. Now this is the ultrasonic cavitation portion of this machine. Layman's terms is it pretty much this is the part that is going to zap your fat cells and then you go in with this part after. This is the body portion of it and this is the face portion. You're going to go in after, and this is what's going to help your body metabolize all of those fat cells that were just zapped. All right, so here are some of the benefits to the ultrasonic cavitation portion of it. It says that it allows your body's fat cells to erupt and metabolize and can effectively burn calories so as to achieve the effect of the reduction of fat, fat cells and cellulite. I'm here for that, for sure. Now moving on to this portion of it right here, it says it promotes lymphatic drainage, firm skin, enhances skin elasticity, can direct the metabolized fat cells after cavitation. Treating with the RF radio frequency device after the cavitation treatment has a direct RF output function on fat cells to accelerate the movement of heat through sweat glands as well as lymph circulation to help the body excrete toxins more proficiently. So benefits to using the body and the face portion of it is that it promotes lymphatic drainage from skin, enhances skin elasticity, and can direct the metabolized fat cells after cavitation. Now these two parts of the machine will light up and has the red light therapy and we all know how amazing red light therapy is for your body. It really helps new cells grow. Also it will help with firmness and elasticity and it's just all around great for your skin. Now with this machine, you cannot use oil. You have to use a water-based lubricant. I prefer this Absonic that you can get off of Amazon. It works great. This is pretty much just ultrasound cream. Or actually, it's called conductive gel. All right, so here's a really quick explanation of how this works. Now, it will come with just this base and you add everything to it. So this is the back side. You go ahead and plug it in right here, and then this is how you turn it on. You just push this red button, and now we are in business. All right, so this is the computer screen right here. You just put, pretty much push any button, it's gonna turn on. So this top part right here, it says cavitation 40. That is for this part right here. The next one is the tripolar, which is tr three. So, I'm sorry, three. So try three, that one right there, the little one. And then a multipolar radio frequency device is this one right here, and this is for your body. So now whenever you're going to be using these, they all have their individual back sides right here. So for example, if I decide I want to start off with this one, which is what I typically do when I use this machine, I'm going to go ahead and find the end. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug it into the side here. 
Now you'll notice that it kind of has like a little divot and then two little prong entry areas right there. So you're going to go ahead and just push that on in there and then screw that on to secure it. All right, so now this one is ready to go. So when I'm finished with this portion of it, I'm going to unplug this. And then when I move on to this, I usually start off with the body one, which is the larger one. I'm gonna go ahead and plug it into this side right here so that they have their own separate sides. We're gonna start off with cavitation right here. So you go ahead and push these buttons until you get to where you wanna be. So I'm gonna to go to the cavitation and then you're gonna go next. So this button right here is the back button. So if you wanna go back to the home screen, you go use that far left one. And if you wanna go up and down on the menu, these are the arrows that you use, these two right here. And then when you wanna select something, you push the far right button. Okay, so now that we are at the main screen for cavitation, you'll notice that it has the timer right here and it starts at 20 minutes and they recommend that you not use it for any longer than 20 minutes. So it's already starting to time down. It is on no level right now, so you have to actually, if you want to, move it up. So I'm gonna go ahead and, here we go, let's go ahead and move this up. So you'll notice the level up here. We are now at level three. It starts making this really weird noise. You can hear it, it's doing that cavitation noise. So I like to, when I'm using this, I go to the highest level. And that is because I always tell people that the strongest, the highest level of an at-home device is usually equivalent to the smallest level of a professional device. So I just figured this really probably can't hurt me, but um, definitely test out the device before you do that. So now let's move on and let's go ahead and unplug this one. And let's plug in this one right here. So I screwed in the multipolar right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and push the down button, the air down arrow until I get to multipolar, there we go. Then I'm going to push this button right here, and now it is on. So it's got the red light on, and this is going to start getting hot. Well, actually not like really hot, but it starts getting warm. It actually feels really good on your skin. So the timer started at 20 minutes, and then I'm going to go ahead and turn this sucker up. As you know me, I just like to go big or go home. There we go. That's how you, that's how you turn it on. It's the exact same process for the small one as well. So let's go ahead and start using this thing. So I bought this machine during quarantine, and I must say that it's a little bit more difficult to do these types of procedures on yourself, especially if you're doing it on your back or the backs of your thighs. If you can go get it done professionally, or if you know someone that can come over and do it for you, that's also probably the better way to go about it. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I do it. I'm not saying it's the correct way. I have read the instructions, and I've watched a lot of videos, and this is just how I have decided to do it. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and bring you guys on the ground with me because that's really the only way for me to show you exactly how I use this on my thighs, my stomach, and underneath my chin. Now, I bought this device during quarantine and my favorite thing to do was to watch, binge watch Netflix and just sit here and use the cavitation machine on myself. Otherwise, to just sit and do it is kind of mind numbing and it gets old really quick, but if you're watching a really good show, then it definitely helps pass the time. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started with the actual cavitation device right here. All right, there we go. So I'm gonna go ahead and start on my thigh. Now an area where I really try to get rid of fat is my saddlebag right here. I've got kind of like a pocket of fat. And then also on my inner thighs right here, it really helps. So I've got on my shorty short shorts that I typically would not wear out in public just for this video. <laughs> so I go ahead and just get some of the ultrasound cream on. Go ahead and put it right on my thigh. You definitely want to just put it on the area you're going to be working on right then. You don't want to rub it all, all over your legs because then your body will absorb the ultrasound cream and then you won't have any left. And this stuff is kind of expensive. Go ahead and rub the additional <laughs> on the rest of my legs. Okay, here we go. So here is the machine. Let's go ahead and turn it on. Got it on cavitation. Push enter, let's crank that sucker all the way up so it's at the highest level. All right, here we go. So we're gonna start off with a cavitation device. Let's go ahead and 
push enter. I'm going to go ahead and crank it all the way up. All right, so it makes this really weird buzzing sound. And I promise the first time you put this on, it's going to feel so weird, but you will get used to it. And it makes the worst sound ever. So I'm going to go ahead and put music over this so you don't have to hear it from here on out. But <laughs> I know it's not awful. It's like it, it really hurts your ears. But you're just going to do this, and I do circular motions. And kind of press, press down a little bit, not too hard. But I'm just going to go all in the areas where I want to get rid of fat. And as the ultrasound cream starts to dry out, add more. You definitely don't want to be using this if you don't have anything for convection. Okay, so to be honest with you, even though it says 20 minutes a day, when I sit down to use this machine, a lot of times I'll use it for almost an hour straight, but I use it in so many different areas that I'm only in one localized area for five minutes. And so that's where that timer comes into play. And usually what I'll do is I'll just do five minutes on each section. So I'll do five minutes on my saddlebags, and then I'll do five minutes on the back of my thighs, and then I'll do five minutes on my inner thighs. So 15 minutes on this leg, and then I'll do five minutes, five minutes, five minutes. I'll do them on my sides here, sides, and then I'll do my stomach. So 15 minutes here. Um, sometimes I will use it on my under my arm, but I must say it has like the weirdest feeling. It feels like it's like zapping my nerves <laughs> under here. I really don't like using it under my arm. But um, so I do use it for a lot longer than they recommend, but I'm not using it for very long in each area, so I don't, I don't know. I don't know if that's bad, but that's just how, what I've done, and I've used it several times, and it's, I feel like it's worked great. So now you might want to start off at like level three or four, because it is kind of an unnerving feeling. It might be a little bit much if you start off at the highest level like I just did, but if you just, you know, start small and then work your way up, it won't bother you anymore. So really quick, I'll show you how I use it under my jaw. Now, if you put it on high and you use it under here, it will literally chatter your teeth. It is the weirdest feeling. I usually will only use it at level three underneath my chin. And so I'll show you how I do that. All right, so we're at level three. And 
I'll do this for just like a little over a minute. I actually don't do this for very long up here. You'll understand why when you do it. I can literally hear this in my brain. It is like chattering my entire head right now. Feels like my teeth are gonna fall out. Like really, that's how it feels. So I do that for about one minute. I've got makeup all over town, lovely. So now we are gonna move on to using the radio frequency devices. So I'm gonna go ahead and unplug this. And since I'm already standing up and I already have the ultrasound cream under my chin, I'm gonna go ahead and use the smaller tripolar device right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the tripolar. So I'm gonna go all the way to the center there, the center selection, I'm gonna push enter. All right, so I forgot to mention that you can also turn the time up and down. So right now I am, I was on the level part portion of it, I'm gonna move down to timer, and then you go up and down. So if you only wanna be doing it for 10 minutes, you can do that, or five, or you can even move it up to 30 to 45 minutes. I'm gonna go back to level, I'm gonna go ahead and turn this sucker all the way up. And it does take a minute to start getting hot, so if you want to wait till it warms up, you can, or you can go ahead and get started. Now, the main purpose of this is to really work out all the fat that just kind of got that got zapped, and also this is helping firm your skin. So you do kind of want to get in there. Oh, I need some more. Thought there was still some on there. This is great for your face. So you don't have to just use this on your chin. I just did my makeup, so I don't really wanna stick it all over my face. But um, what I recommend doing is washing your face and then getting this ultrasonic device or this ultrasonic gel all over your face and then just get in there and start massaging. Helps for reproducing collagen. And don't be afraid to be a little rough. Get in there. Like I said before, this is really great if you've done the fat dissolvers. I've, I, there's a video below if you wanna see how to do that, but with the Hyaluron pen, you can use fat dissolvers. It helps to zap the fat, or it actually helps dissolve the fat in your body, and then you go in with this, and this will help your body metabolize it. And when I do my face, I like to, I'll go in circular motions, but I also like to kind of push in upward directions. I'll just get in there and, oh, see, it's already starting to warm up. Feels good. You can use this anywhere. Use it all over your face, on your forehead, under your eyes. Feels great. So this is really great for your face. Let's move on to the body one. Okay, so I've got it on the highest level. I'm gonna show you how I use it on my body. You really wanna get in there work out that cellulite. And the great thing is, is this kind of acts as a fascia blaster, very similar to the bottom of a fascia blaster, and this will really help to smooth out your fascia, help your body to get rid of all of the toxins and the fat cells that have just been zapped. So really just work it in there.
time, some wipes. I'm going to go ahead and wipe all of that gel off of my body. Also, you're going to want to wash all of the ultrasound gel off of the machine as well. So the company that makes this machine says that it takes about 12 sessions before you start to see results. I saw results after about four to five sessions. Really just depends on your body and how you metabolize it. One really important thing to do is to drink a lot of water. That's pretty much a rule of thumb for all the procedures I do. Water really helps with your body getting rid of toxins, and especially with a procedure like this, when you are zapping fat cells, you want your body to flush that out, and it helps flush it out if you drink a lot of water. So definitely do that. Hope you all enjoyed this video. If you want to see more behind the scenes and you want to see the before and afters of this procedure, definitely go to my Instagram page. I save everything in the highlights. You can go ahead and watch kind of the behind the scenes and the progress as the months go on. But also love it if you would hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you want to know every time a new video drops on Wednesdays. Also, if you want to go check out my website, I have a lot of downloadable free resources. So would love it if you would check that out. Hope you all have a fabulous day and I'll see you soon. Yeah.